And when I see the people, I start laughing at my head. Like, me, I put on a little smile at the exam because I say, I do what this. Oh, welcome back, guys. Welcome back to the channel. So, in today's video, we will be discussing C sec social studies. So, how to pass C sec social studies. So, if you're interested in this video, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. For me, doing C sec, when I was doing C sec social studies, I would say it was actually one of the easier subjects for me to do you get me I said so if you're here and so if you're here and you want to pass CSEC social studies I'm gonna tell you what you need to do the first um, ingredient to passing CSEC social studies is literally um listening in class like for me if I never did study, I never do nothing. But once you did actively pay attention in class throughout the school year, you yeah, got have an idea of what to write on that paper. Like, I don't think I ever like grasp a subject the way or I grasped, I grasped social studies. I don't think I ever grasp a subject like that because, I don't know, maybe just like your day. Things them when they just like your body Caribbean and more this and more that and more what Trinidad and Jamaica Dina things and it be like your body some of them. So I did actually pay attention in a social studies class. And it's actually it and family and resource management I'd say are probably two of the easier subjects to pass, like literally. Literally guys. And so once you are actively paying attention um throughout the school year, you won't have a problem passing social studies, you won't. But just in case there's somebody who probably never got you no know, social studies class, them did have gone, but they were occupied with other things, just chatting with them friends, or texting on them phone, or watch a video of in earpods or something, and I pay the teacher of mine. Just in case there's someone or somebody's like that, I'm gonna say that need to do pass social studies. Key to passing social studies now. For me, let me tell you what, when I discovered social studies with Suarez, literally a Monday, like that teacher, social studies with Suarez on YouTube. Me say, when me that do social, I'm a fine him channel, you know, like put aside listening to the teacher in class. When I found that teacher's channel on YouTube, it changed my life. Because let me tell you, you know, when I prepare for social studies, I'm not going to lie, I did kind of somewhat, I wouldn't want to say lazy, but it was just a lot to go over, if I get on me. So like, other than what you listen to from the teacher, social studies is a lot of reading, it's a lot of going over all these things. And so when I book up on him channel now, and I saw um three, there were three videos, like I think the, the C6 social studies syllabus has, um, three modules for social studies the family um regional integration and something else but when i book up on that man channel and i tell you say me literally watch the man talk about the things them and remember me watching because at the time i said listen i've been studying from Wapi king philip and sometimes let's be honest when you have to prepare for your exam them sometimes the information just too much it's just too much and you can't bother because you go to the work and it's like it seems like the work now I go down because when you're done I said yes it almost said still left back so at the time now I said alright I need to pass social you know social I need to do it because I remember you know, at the time I do it in the great end but when I said that when I book up on him channel I said the man go through the videos them and him basically you know him cover a good amount like it's a summary you know, but him cover a good amount you know like him mentioned the main points you know I'm going to tell you, I'm going to watch them and I understand and I say, I know where this is, I know that, I know that, yeah, I know what's going on. I'm going to tell you, say, no. when I go up on him channel more, I'm going to say, alright, this teacher have past papers of social studies at work. Hello, my head did just fly off, so I say, hear what, are you going to make me pass this exam? Like, you, social studies with stories, are going to make me pass this exam, like, literally. When I tell you, say, I go pan it, I'm sitting on watch past papers of the past paper. Hey, like, me da lose my attention span with the, if you look through the work, if you read me notes, then me da get tired of it, to be honest. Me I tell you, say, my book up on him channel. And I'm not saying that you know for read the notes, cause yes, go back read the notes to the teacher again and go through your work. But me I say, mix up the studying, like, mix it up, the little bit of reading, 
the look a bit of watching watching some youtube videos doing some past papers you get what i mean i say and when i say youtube videos i mean the one with the past papers them because i don't know if you have the time to sit down on a print past paper and um a circle but me never have the time so what do you think me though i'll watch him work the paper let me tell you say you see the brain the brain is a mystery because the funny thing is that you see when we sit down and watch them pass the past papers the videos them when do with the mcq's paper one multiple choice me I tell you it's like my brain taking the answer them on a different level my brain taking the answer them on a different level my brain absorb it you get what me i say because when me go in an exam and me see about the same question them it's like me not even for look too hard panning me just know say that the answer you get what me i say and that was what those passive videos and social studies with sorority's channel did for me i know about one you know but if you try if you if you want to say a pass social studies aside from using a textbook and using a teacher you'd have gone that youtube channel you would go on social studies with Sora's YouTube channel and yes me I direct you to that because me I tell you it make me pass social on some different level. I it get me the grade one in a social studies, you get me I say. Maybe if you did just listen to your teacher throughout the school year, you probably get a grade three, you still pass, that's fine. But me I tell you say when I did those past papers, me watch them and it's like my other sudden me have photographic memory come me I tell you say my brain taking the answer them pass on different levels level taking the answer i'm going to exam i'm tell you say i'm gonna talk this enough time for the channel before i'm gonna tell you say me go in at that social studies exam the paper one and it's like out of the 60 questions 58 of them missing them already i saw 58 out of the 60 questions before I'm going to tell you, so like, it's never normal. I'm going to say, I'm going to exam. I'm going to tell you, so guys, when I went into that social studies exam, I'm going to say, I must do this. Like, people used to tell me, say, all right, you know, say, CXC, um, repeat them um, questions, but you know, say, you're just in the system, right? You don't know whether you believe people, yes or no. But I'm going to tell you, say, me go in that exam, and I'm going to 58 out of the 60 questions. Like, the paper never knew to me. I've seen these questions on past papers. I see them. And when I see the people, I start laughing at my head. Like, me I put on a little smile at the exam. Because me I say, I do it this. I have to look on the front and make sure I say the right year. They have on it, you know. When I look on it, I say the right year. I say, oh, I'm an exam for this year, this. Full of past paper. Hey, it never normal. It never normal. I tell you, say, guys, do not underestimate past papers. Because them I will get you through this. Do not underestimate it. You're not smart for pass CXE. You know what I'm saying? You're not a pass, you're not smart for pass it. You don't have to smart for pass it because enough people run through that system here like that. Just like that. I never smart them smart. Them just know how the system work. You get me saying? So when I went on social studies with Suarez channel, I may tell you so I may say past papers of the past papers. I may sit down and watch those past papers. And as I said, it's not no one year past paper y'all watch so like we're in 2023 i don't expect you to just go and watch one for 2021 or pass paper video for 2021 no that can't get, that can't get you the grade you want to get me answer what you need to do like me i tell you so when i was in my exam i watched from 2011 because i did my exam in 2020 I watched past paper videos from 2011 go straight to 2019. So if you want to ensure say CXC you no know, pull up on you and you know the question I'm already, you do as many past papers as you can because CXC can take question from way back home. Because we say we can't forget the time when um me not the exam, the same social studies exam. And to, to be honest, you know, because we did don't want too much past paper videos, I said, alright, I don't need to watch the 2012 um, past paper one, right? I don't need to watch the 2012 paper one for social studies past paper, right? I don't need to watch it because I don't do so much already. I tell you, say, God said, I go watch that 2012 one, the last one I watch, I say, you know what? And even it had repeated questions, you forget me, I said. And so, when I did they know, I'm watch it, I'm going to the exam and see one question and then take from 2012, I say, oh, okay, but you see, oh God, that send me if you can watch the past paper, you see. Literally, guys, social studies is nothing for bust your brain about too hard, you hear me saying? Literally, literally, by watching past paper videos for the paper one, you can match up social studies paper one easy, just like that. 
as for the people to know your stuff like CAC love ask a certain type of question like please look upon the past papers then for the paper too and when I say that I don't mean that oh the paper too um, questions I'm gonna repeat exactly like that but there's a context where them always put the questions in they get what me I say so it's up to you for interest so you know something you know the content right the family the entire topic and the family it's simple math you know say simple math definitions of family the different types of family maths that are quick and fast literally like even regional integration you just go through that box it up quick and fast it's not if you are clear your brain about too hard if you get me i say you would check out social studies with stories channel because i tell you say uh, it make me pass it make me pass social studies it make me get a grade one at social studies i'm mean, not i don't talk because me i tell you say up to the night before the exam i film channel made it depend on him channel made it that bad. so if you are trying to get that one day in a social studies watching channel but guys other than that you have to do look at study pain oh and get me and say if you have a textbook go, just go through your notes like social studies is a subject where i think if you read it if you read it and you understand it you're gonna remember it you're gonna remember say so, oh trinidad and jamaica the inner things and something about carry come and a simple mass, just go through the stuff, guys. Literally, just go through the stuff, go through the content, look on your syllabus, guys. And sure, say so you have your syllabus. Don't tell me, say, exams won't come out. Someone don't know see the syllabus. Ah, no, God, that bad, no. Grab out, download the syllabus from cxc.org, get the syllabus, go through once. All right, we know they're married, we know they're married, and match it up quick and fast. Like, go through and know the format of your exam, guys. I mean, I tell you, say, see, say, social studies is not for your boss, you're really too hard about. If you study, just read over your notes and come through, and you do some passives for the paper one, and even answer some questions for the paper two, simple maths, you know, master that up on your pass, quick and easy, just like that. Figure out me, I say. So now, other than you doing a pass papers and read over your notes and things, you need to enter it, say, you have a good SBA going at the exam. So don't tell me, say, your SBA and ask you nothing, like ensure say your SB good going into the exam because believe it or not sometimes that SB where you feel like say you should you never you know have to do you know matter just look up look up marks that that same SB can make the difference between you getting a grade three and you getting a grade four it can make the difference with you getting a grade one or a grade two so up to you now if you know say all right going into the exam me know my SB grade higher my SB grade is nice it's up to you to know what that's gonna get me So guys, do the right thing, ensure your SBA good when into the exam. As a matter of fact, by now, most of you, most of you guys should have finished your SBA by now. SBA should have done you now. So just do that, ensure your SBA good going into the exam, and with your past papers, you do all of that. But if you feel like so, oh, you want to print some past papers, you want to write them down, and you want to time yourself, no problem. You can go up on CSEC past papers that come and find some um, past papers if you want to like print it. Forget me, I say. If you just want to see the answer, them just go on social studies with Sorry's YouTube channel. And if there are other YouTube channels on YouTube, you just write in CSEC social studies um, on YouTube and you see oh, everything just pop up just like that. So, guys, you have no excuse. So, please study. Do your past papers then make sure your SBA good do other things that we need to do. So this year CXC can't say oh people not pass. So, I guess so I pay grade one, grade two, and grade three. I'll go roll out this year, right? But that is the end of today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe and comment down below which um subject you're having like the most the hardest time with right now. What subject you're having the hardest time with right now? Just comment down below and that's the end of today's video. Thank you.